friends, it is Audrey and welcome back to my studio. So today I am with Click Kits and I am sharing my uh, story seven in my December daily album. If you've been following along with me, you know that I am not doing a uh, daily story, that I am doing um, 26 actually because I like to celebrate Boxing Day. Uh, 26 stories related to the Christmas and holiday season in December. So I am using today the, uh, let me see if I can pull it out here, yes, the um, Simple Stories uh, Holidays collection from, uh, from Click Kits International. And uh, I put together this story about my sister and I when we were young uh, and my one of my most favorite memories involving holiday music. So uh, this is a picture of my sister and I from when we were young and uh, this is the story. So without further ado, let's dive in and see how this came together. Thank you for watching friends. Okay friends, so let's get started. So I'm using the Click Kits um, Simple Stories Holidays Sampler Kit to uh, do uh, the story in my December Daily album. I believe this is story seven, I want to say. Um, yeah, I think this was six. Yep, that's six. So this is story seven. Okay. So story seven, so story seven starts on the right side. Um, so I'm planning to do it in essentially two pages, like a cover page on the top. And then oh, there's some glue or something in my album. I could put a sticker or something on that when this is all done. It's probably coming from this page. But anyway, all right. So, this is a story about my sister and I um, and a Christmas memory of listening to the song Feliz Navidad uh, before we woke up uh, on Christmas morning. So, I love this photo of the two of us because it's, it's a little blurry, so it's really kind of dreamy, but it also has the date on there, um, which was Christmas 1983. So that was, uh, that's a, that's one of my favorite photos. Okay. So my, so I have this, um, transparency. I might, if it doesn't really match, I might pull out a different transparency from my stash, but I kind of wanted to use this up. This was offered in of an older Click Kits uh, kit. I believe it was called A Beautiful Life. It was back in, um, I can't get this peeled off, but it was back uh, fall of 2020, I believe, or 2019. Um, I'm not sure when it was offered, but anyway, I have it hanging around here. It's got kind of silver on the back. Let's just make sure that this, yeah. It's got kind of a silver on the back, um, black on the front. So my idea is to put one of these big stickers to make it half and half and put one of these big stickers in the middle of it. So this layout should come together fairly quickly. What story seven? I don't really like the, the number here. So now it's just really picking out um, the backing papers that I'm going to want. And I might put a tag in. Uh, so I'm going to set that one aside. Oh, I do kind of like this one. But I'm not sure if that... Oh, this is, this is fun. I'm looking for something that's kind of... Alright, so I think... I 
this one is a good one. I want some black. I wanted to really be able to complement the black, and I really kind of like this with what the story says. And the back will look good with the silver. So I think I'm going to use this one. It's definitely one that I'm going to use. The Hey Santa and the Ho 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 on the back. And then the other one. I need one. So I need one that's going to kind of provide a backing because I didn't want to stretch this out or, or resize it because I really like the photo as it is. I could have done a 4x4, four four, but I figured I'd put a little embellishment over here. So, um, a little embellishment over here. I'm sorry about the lighting. I have, um, Barley, what are you doing? Sorry, the cat, my cat is going a little nutso. So, let's see what... Maybe I'll do that. It's too busy. could back it with this one. Actually, I kind of like that idea. Alright, that's what we're going to do. Okay, have a plan. So, this is what I'm going to do. I am going to um, cut and size this out. Um, and then I'm going to back it together. And I will, um, I'm going to use the washi tape to bring it together. Um, and once I'm done getting all of this laid out, where's the, oh, here's the story. Okay, so once I am done getting it all laid out, then I will uh, meet you back here so I can tell you what I did and I can also show you um, the next steps. All right, so let's get this going. Alexa. Play Christmas music on Audrey's Spotify. got the paper set up how I wanted it. So what I did was I decided to cut the picture a little bit smaller. I'm going to end up popping it up with pop dots just to give this some dimension here. Um, the story is going to get put on the back here. And I left a little box here because I'm going to embellish it with um, something from the die cut collection probably the Santa Claus but we'll see maybe maybe joy that might be cute we'll see but anyway so I'm going to uh, well, it's not that bad that's gonna annoy the Jesus out of me but I don't want to reprint the picture all right so anyway I'm going to um, put the story down to 
beading if I want. I think the story's just going to get put down. I'm going to put the story down, I'm going to pop the picture up, and then I'm going to embellish this. Um, I was debating, I didn't put it right on the cardboard yet, because I was debating if I wanted to embroider around the edge of the picture, which I still might do. Um, or I might just pop it up. But if I embroider it around the edge, I'd probably want to embroider on this one now. We're just going to pop it up, the picture. All right, so I'm going to get that going. I'm going to pop up the picture now, and then I'm going to figure out uh, how I want to embellish this. Um, so I'm going to speed up this video, and I'll meet you back after the embellishments are done. Um, and we can go through what I did. All right, let's go. Alexa, play. Alexa, play. Alexa. Alexa, play Christmas music on Audrey's Spotify. From Audrey's Spotify. Alexa, play Christmas favorites on Audrey's Spotify. Okay, friends, so my last part here is just attaching it to the cardboard. If you've been following along with my videos, my December daily videos, you'll know that I use, um, I've been backing all of my uh, outside the page protector spreads on uh, this chipboard that I bought on Etsy because it just makes the page a little bit more sturdy um, and hopefully it will last in the long run so it'll it'll hopefully make the page last longer um i have about i think i've been doing this project for i don't even know now six or seven years but i've recently started going outside the page protectors maybe i would say the last three years and everything has been pretty decent and it's stayed um as it should uh, but who knows what it's going to be like in the long term and um, I have no intentions to stop scrapbooking but if I do at some point I know that December Daily will always be the project that I will um, come back to and, and do because um, it's my favorite time of year and my favorite project so I want these memories to last as long as they can. Um, so anyway, that's my little soapbox speech, but uh, take it for what it is. And I guess it's not really a soapbox, it's just kind of a informative. Anyway, um, so that is that. So, all right. So what I did was I, there was some sort of like yellow piece of paper on the back of this, so I just covered it up, um, popped up the Santa Claus, 
added the gifts. Uh, so I really like how this actually came out. Um, it's pretty, came out pretty good. So.